And this is how we make hidden and hidden sheets or apps in Excel using a shape as a button with a VBA code. Hello my friends, this is Atich and welcome to my video. Well, first I would like to explain you how it's important to make visible or invisible some sheets. Why? Number one, organization. When we are working in a large workbooks, it's very helpful to have these uh, sheets visible or invisible. Two, privacy. Because sometimes we are sharing some files where uh, we don't want to share this information with others, so it's important to make it visible or invisible. Focus. When we have a very, very large files, you can focus on the ones or the sheets that you want to work only. Then we have the last one, printing. When, we, when you want to print a, a complete file, it's important to have only the, the important ones that uh, you want to print. Perfect, let's start this test. So we're going to take as a base the file that we did uh, time ago, where we are changing the color of the shape by clicking on it. So this time we are going to reduce, we are going to make it like a button. We are going to, to take out the grad lines to make it pretty. We are going to insert a title for this sheet. We're going to call it home. We're going to place it on the top of the sheet. And then we are going to insert another text just to, to be helpful for the one that is uh, performing this task. Okay, so we are going to call it make sheets visible. We're going to reduce a little bit the size, obviously, for other purposes, you can use several buttons uh, to make this action happen. Uh, for, for example, we are going to click on this button and we are going to, to make visible two sheets. If we click on other button, we, we can make visible other three sheets or the same sheets and, and so on. So we rename the name of the sheet, we call it home, and we are going to insert three more sheets. Inputs, process, and summary. For this purpose, we are going to use inputs and process as our test to make it visible, visible or visible or hidden and hidden. Okay, so we change as well the name of the sheets just to make it uh, visible for this test. Okay, we're going to hide because we want uh, when we click on on the button to perform the hide of the of the of the two tabs. Okay. So we are going to use worksheets, the name of the first one, that is inputs. We close parentheses. We are going to use instruction of visible equal true. So we copy the same sentence and we paste and then we change the name of the sheet that we want to make it visible. This time is process. Okay, so we come back to the Excel and we test. Okay, so we click on the shape and then it's changing the color of the shape and is making visible the two tabs that we want to make it visible. But if we push back in the button, so it's not, uh, are not hidden. So we need to, to perform this uh, access as well in the VBA. So, Basically, we copy the sentence with that we did, and in, instead of true, we change to false. Okay, so let's come back. We come back to Excel. So we see that they're not visible. Okay, if we click on that, they are making visible. If we click back, they are hidden. But if you see when we are clicking on the on the button, it's changing. Uh, to the other tab. So for this for this case we have to call worksheet home to be activate always even if we perform any other action. Okay, so we come back to Excel to make the final test. And if you see this is how you can make hidden and hidden sheets by using a button. Thanks a lot for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video and see you in the next one.